Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video, we're going to be checking out the buffed AMR9 class setup in Modern Warfare 3. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. Let's try to get this video to 60 likes. I'd highly appreciate it and it helps out the channel a bunch. So over on the uh, secondary, I'm using the Karambit. The tactical is the stem. Lethal, frag grenade. Field upgrade is munitions box. Gloves is scavenger. So I can pick up ammo off of people that I have killed. Running sneakers for the boots, and this is basically to increase your tax sprint, and it reduces, like, the refresh time. And over on the gear, I'm using EOD padding. Demolition vest is basically resupply, and it gives you two lethals. Jumping straight over into the attachments over on the stock, I'm going to be using the Hellhound Carbine stock for gun kick control and recoil control. You lose a little bit of aim down sight speed, but it's not too noticeable. And over on the rear grip, we're going to be using the Phantom Grip. This is to gain back the aim down sight speed, and it gives you sprint to fire speed. Over on the ammo, I'm going to be using the high grain rounds for bullet velocity and damage range. And over on the barrel, I'm using the AMR9 Commando Pro Barrel. This barrel is basically just to give you a little bit of aim down sight speed, sprint to fire speed, movement speed, and sprint speed. You can go with any of these, honestly. I think they're all pretty decent, but this is by far my favorite one. And this is preference, but I'm using the Slate Reflector. You can go with any other attachment that you want to make this better if you like the iron sights. But personally, the Slate Reflector is really, really good. That's going to do it for this class setup. If you guys end up trying this class setup out and you like it, let me know down in the comments. I have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy that. And if you do, let me know with a like, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. A small percentage of people that watch my videos are subscribed, so if you like this video, consider subscribing, and also follow me on Twitch where I stream and play with followers. Also, if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter where you can stay up to date with me, and I also have a Discord, so if you'd like to, we can connect more on there. Now let's get back to the video. Alright, we're going to be checking out the buffed AMR9. I was just using this gun last game, and it actually feels so good. Like, I was just trying to test it out, make sure the attachments were right. The class setup was good enough. There's a YouTube guy on the other team. Let's see who's better. I don't really want to go for a nuke, but I, again, I do kind of. I just want to get like more than 60, 70 kills, or or at least 70 kills, if I don't get a nuke. Like, wh why are why are you playing like this? Oh my gosh. The only problem I have is just keep like my teammates sitting on the hill or not sitting on the hill at all. Like, like I get it. I'm slaying out, but I need my teammates to not play the objective so much to the point where the game ends in like five minutes because I can't upload that. I mean, I could do that if I get a nuke and then upload another gameplay like a TDM or something. I was actually thinking about doing that. I might start doing that for no one. Oh man, what is... Where am I getting shot from? What is he doing? Can't even get a, a veto right now. Let's see.
Okay. I don't know what we're on, but. Oh. What in the world? Getting flashed now by this this kid. Calling the UAV in. God, I'm, I'm like one shot. That kid's gonna keep coming after me. Let's um, let's hide over here real quick. Call this VTOL in. I'm gonna call it like near them. That guy loves it. I run at 21. They're spawning over there. We could definitely get this. Oh my god. What a nade. That's 30 right there. That's the nuke, baby. Let's go. 49 kills, too. They're just sitting over here, huh? No. I thought they were. We gotta call the nuke in in a second. Maybe it's a good thing that my teammates did hop on the hill. Because I don't think we, I would have gotten the nuke of that game or this game. Oh my God, he spawned on me. Fifty-six kills. Um, I don't know if I should call it in yet because we're still, still kind of frying. They're not really jumping on the hill. I think that was a new sub, whoever that was, I appreciate you. Alright, let's go. We don't win off of that, so... Oh god, that guy has overpressured rounds. Oh, we gotta call it in, we gotta call it in. It's too close. Sixty nine or seventy kills with the MGB GG's.